Hi friends, welcome to Make It Monday, where we embrace imperfection and try new things. My name is Leslie and I am the Reading Machine and Stream Coordinator for Monterey County Free Libraries. And today we're going to be making this awesome and adorable little frog. Cute, huh? He's even got his cute little tongue. All right, so in order to make this um, frog, you will need these things, of course this toilet paper tube, some paper. I have these different colors, green, red, black, and white. Now, if you don't have any colored paper, you can always just use white paper and then color it with a marker or crayon, whatever you wanna do. You will need some kind of straight edge or ruler. I'm using this because I couldn't find a ruler, so it's kind of the closest thing I could find. You can also use the edge of a book or something else that's straight if you don't have a ruler. You will need a pair of scissors and a glue stick and a pen and a pencil. Might not need them both, but I used both of them. So grab these materials and let's get started. The first step in this project is to cover the toilet paper tube in green paper. So how I did that was I took the toilet paper tube and I wanted to see how much of the paper it would take to cover it. So I'm holding it like this, kind of doing a little measurement and I'm gonna mark it right here because that shows how long the toilet paper tube is, okay? Then I'm going to use my straight edge to measure so I can draw a straight line and for me, this is really helpful because I am not good at drawing straight lines. And I'm going to say that if we cut about this much of the paper, that'll be good, probably good to cover the toilet paper tube in its entirety. So I'm going to cut that out. And with this rectangle, let's do a little, just a little quick measure here. With this rectangle, we can roll it onto the tube like this to test it. Look, I've got a completely covered tube. And so now it's time for the glue stick. Well, I think it's possible to use regular glue if you prefer. I have picked glue stick because it is a little bit neater and liquid glue can be kind of messy. And I'm already messy enough, so I decided to try and make it easier on myself. So I'm gonna just roll this on. We can stick it on really good like this, and then keep doing that as we roll it on. All right, so we just give it a good pat down like this. Make sure that it's really good on there. This is kind of sticking up a little bit, so I'm going to add a little more glue here. So there we go. I got that on there. And then I've got a covered toilet paper tube. The next thing that I'm going to do is to draw one really cute frog foot, okay? So I'm gonna draw my frog foot right here and it's gonna look kind of like that. If you can see, that's my frog foot, okay? It needs to be rounded a little more at the bottom. I'm gonna do that. And instead of trying to draw a very identical second foot, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to fold this paper in half and cut along the lines of my original frog foot, and then I will have two that are symmetrical. All right, here are my two frog feet. Cute, huh? Now I'm gonna make my frog legs, and my frog legs are just going to be long strips of green paper, two of them. So I'm gonna do one here. I'm gonna use my straight edge again. And then I'm gonna do the other one next to it and use my straight edge again. And I'm going to cut out these pieces, these strips. Okay, and then we're going to fold them in half and then we'll make a crease, okay? 
And this is going to be our frog legs. Now we are going to glue our legs and feet on this. And this part can be a little, little tricky. Um, just do the best you can. I'm gonna take my glue stick and I'm going to put some glue outside and inside. So I'm gonna kind of glue my frog, the bottom of my frog legs together. And then I'm going to put it, glue it to the side of this, of its body. Okay. And you can hold that for a minute to let it dry. And then we'll do the second one. Okay, so now we got frog legs. And we're going to take our frog feet and put a little bit of glue here at the bottom, the very bottom of the foot, okay? And then we're gonna stick this So what I'm doing is I'm kind of folding it and gluing the bottom of the foot to the inside of the cardboard tube so that it has a place to sit. And I'm gonna do that with the second one as well. So now we've got our frog and legs and our frog feet and isn't that so cute? The next thing to do is to make some eyes. And with that, I'm going to use my white paper. I am going to draw one circle the best I can. And then I'm going to do my trick from earlier so that I can cut out two circles at once and they'll be identical. We're gonna do the same with the black for the pupils. So I'm gonna draw one black circle here, smaller than the white circles because that's gonna be the pupil on the frog. Let me show you. The black part is the pupil. And we're gonna cut out this, the black part and then we will be able to glue on our eyes. So now I have my little pupils. The next thing we're going to do is take the eyes that we made and glue them together. So we're gonna glue our little pupil onto each eyeball like this. And you can make yours look however you want. If you wanna make them look, your frog looking up, you can put the pupils near the top of the eye. If you wanna make him looking cross-eyed, you can do that. Whatever you want, anything goes, you know how I am. Then, once we have those made, I am going to put some glue here on my frog. And I am going to stick my eyes on so that they are kind of a little higher than the frog's body. So they're kind of up like this, I'm slightly overlapping. There we go, we got his eyes. He's really cute, he looks a little, little goofy right now. Next thing to do after we've got that done is I'm gonna draw a smile on him, okay? So it's gonna be right here. Smile. There we go, cute little smile. And to go along with that smile, I am going to give him a tongue. And the tongue is going to be cut out from red paper and I'm just kind of eyeballing it. I'm going to cut up this, just a small strip of paper. And then because I want it to kind of curl up, I'm going to wrap it around my pencil like this. And see, we got a nice little curly tongue like that. And then I'm going to glue it on onto his mouth. So in order to do that, I'm gonna fold this part here that's not curly under like that. And then I'm going to put glue right here on this little flap. So that'll be the thing that sticks to the toilet paper tube and his tongue will be hanging off. So he'll be kind of like, he's got like a 3D tongue, which I think is super cute.
And there, look, there's our frog. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. That's what I've got for you today, friends. These cute little toilet paper frogs. Thank you so much for joining me for another episode of Make It Monday. I hope that you have a wonderful week. I hope that you have fun making this frog. Until then, make sure you make something, stay curious, stay safe, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.